Hi Brooke, this is Paul Hatfield from Shearer Volkswagen. Uh, I wanted to shoot you a quick video to show you the size comparison between the Atlas and the Crossport. Uh, you can read about it, but it's a lot easier to see, and video, I think, shows it a lot better than pictures. Uh, the, this Atlas here is an S model. It's the only one we had with the bench seat, so it is the entry level, and then the other one is the SE with technology, uh, which is the third trim up out of the five. Uh, but I'm going to focus on the space here for this video. Uh, so you'll see here with the seats folded, you know, you have a 60-40 split up front, 50-50 in the back, and they all fold completely flat. So your cargo space uh, would be very easy to access here. Uh, you do have these pull tabs on the side, so you can easily pull up that third row and convert it into passenger space. But more than enough space for a few spaniels in the back here. And then in the second row, um, you know, pretty simple. You just pull that lever uh, to then lift the seat up. Just very difficult with the phone in my hand here. Uh, but you'll see plenty of space. And that second row is very adjustable, so it's easy for passengers to get into the third row should you choose uh, to use it. And then this cross sport, this is an SE with technology trim, so it's the midline out of the five trims. Um, and you'll see that it only has two rows, but still substantial space behind the back seat. Uh, the back end slopes off a whole lot more than it does in the Atlas, and you lose, I think it's about 10 inches in length uh, overall, but plenty of space uh, for a few smaller dogs in the back. And then enormous space for your, uh, for your passengers in the second row. Uh, I would say if you're really only gonna use the two rows, it might even be more comfortable in these two rows for the, uh, um, you know, in the Crossport rather than the Atlas. Uh, though your roof line does slope off a little bit, so you do lose a little bit of headroom, might be best to bring one of your uh, six foot friends with you. Um, and then if we come up front, uh, you'll see, you know, this, appears like most of them appear. Uh, so you have a full power driver seat, leather wrapped steering wheel, um, Bluetooth and cruise control accessible right from the steering wheel, nice MFI screen in front of you. You have dual zone automatic climate control, heated leather at seats, um, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto on the back, uh, on the radio, and then a backup camera as well. Uh, so, I just wanted to give you a quick preview. I'll give you um, kind of a shot from the other side as well. Um, again, my name is Paul Hatfield from Shearer Volkswagen. We've been emailing, and uh, let me know what you think. Thanks.